the group heads to the whitewater rafting site for a winding road leading past rice paddies. They stop off on the way to view two waterfalls cascading into the river. A spectacular sight through the dense tropical forest. Yes. Nice meeting you. Oh, thank you. Welcome to Nimano Rifo. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome to Warane Rafting. My name is Frankie Poas. I'm the owner of Warane Rafting. Let me introduce our rafting operation. The distance of whitewater rafting is about 9 kilometers. It takes 2 hours and 30 minutes on the river. Although the team looks anxious, the Warrani White Water Rafting takes as safety as a prime concern, so Sam is in good hands. <laughs> the river is extremely strong today due to previous heavy rain, and the volume of water is high. This does mean that it is easy for the flat bottom boat to bounce down the rapids. The group are now coming up to the most challenging section of the river and need to negotiate it carefully. Whoa! Whoa! And indeed, they were successful. Samu, yes. how did you enjoy? I enjoyed so much. Thank you very much. It was exciting. Thank you very much. Come back again. Yes. I'll do, I'll do, I'll come back again. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye bye. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you very much. Yeah, bye bye. They were soon led to the small village of Huotan. Due to the high quality clay sourced from the local area, the entire village has turned into one cottage industry, producing clay pots and stools supplying the local market. We just arrived at a pottery town called Puruta, which was advised by the uh, pottery sellers I met on the street. And this pottery is called Mawa. And there are quite many pottery factories in this Putan town. And Mawar is the best one in the town. So let's go inside and watch what they are making now. Isamo enjoys pottery and ceramics, and Freddy invites him to join him at the potter's wheel. Would you like to try? Oh, can I? Please. Okay, thank you very much. This is very professional made. <laughs> Okay, this is the flower pot. Ferdi taught me how to make the flower pot. Ferdi, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. 
are. They dry the fresh pottery in one day in the strong sun in the dry season. And this can take one week in the wet season. After the potter is dry, they place it in the kiln and bake it for 24 hours. Firstly, they make a small fire outside of the kiln. Then gradually increase the fuel supply and the temperature until it increases from 200 degrees up to 800 degrees. Finally, the kiln is closed to keep the heat in. Kanana Thermal Valley is locally known as Bukit Doa and is located less than 30 minutes southeast of Kulatan village. Here I am at uh, Kanana Thermal Valley where the uh, uh, quite many hot springs are uh, bubbling and 100 degrees, uh, which is supplied by uh, volcano Soputa. So I'm going to make a hot roll, a hot spring A. Uh, it takes about seven minutes to boil, half boil, and we can enjoy the uh, uh, hot boiled egg from the Canon and Thermal Valley uh, hot spring. It takes seven minutes to boil, half boiled egg. Beautiful, very good. This location is well known to religious North Sulawesi people as the holiest site in Indonesia and they are obliged to make a pilgrimage to worship here at least once in their lifetime. Recently, several churches and temples have been constructed on the edge of the peak, in addition to religious monument. The slope consists of volcanic stones and is covered with sulfur and small hot springs gush out of the ground like tiny geysers. This is the hot boiled egg. Oh, it's very hot. <laughs> so this is the perfect one. This is the perfect hot spring egg. I can swallow it. Hot. <laughs> very good. This is the hot boiled egg. Onsen egg. Hot spring egg. Very good. Very good.
As we depart Pulatan, we enter the scenic region coming into Urongo, which is the gateway to the Tondano Lake District, the last region to explore in this program. The sign symbolises the important contribution farming makes to this region. The comfortably cooler climate in this area means that an abundance of flowers grow around the lake area, and the lush environment and cool breezes are inviting. Approaching Tondana Lake is a small, elegant resort with bungalow-type rooms, all of which face the lake. There are so many interesting and attractive places to see. We decided to stay at this lakeside hotel tonight. Tondano Lake Hotel. My name is Enga Ware. I am the owner of this hotel. Welcome once again and enjoy your stay here. Thank you. Terima kasih. Enga is proud to escort Isamo around the property and to show him to his guest room for the evening. Isamo, yes, thank you. Ah, oh, it's nice. This is a Chinese? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Korean. 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 Yes. Yes. Have my stay here. Thank you very much, Mr. Wallet. I do. Thank you. Tondano Lake is famous for its abundance of freshwater carp and tiny lake fish all of which are caught and served as a specialty at the numerous small restaurants dotting the lake. The restaurants are popular amongst tourists and locals alike who enjoy the lakeside views and delicious fresh produce. Uh, Nikke, little bit from this lake. This lake? Looks like a small yeah. This is the giant car. Yeah. 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 And these are the beautiful uh, uh, car uh, dishes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, very good, very good. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Samu, yes. enjoy your meal. Thank you. Let's try the fish. Okay, uh, this is the uh, uh, freshwater carp, which is uh, grilled on a charcoal. Let me try. This is the one, the uh, carp. Mmm, very good, very tasty. <laughs> very good. This is egg. Mmm. Very good. I found uh, two uh, black macaques 
at this uh, hotel garden. Uh, they had uh, no name, so I named them a typical Japanese first name, Taro and Hanako. Taro means boy's name, and Hanako is girl's name. And here's a uh, Hanako. Hanako. <laughs> Okay, Hanako, come here. Oh, it's good, delicious. <laughs> this is Hanako. <laughs> Hanako, take my hair. Yes. Up there. What did you find? I have no fleas in my hair. Yeah, this is Taro. <laughs> yeah, Taro, Taro. I know, I know you like me. Bye bye. Say, bye bye. Say, thank you. Bye bye. Hundreds of reef herons fly over the lake area every day. Yeah. Hello, that's oh, oh, yeah. Hello, hello, hello. Wow, hello, hello. They fly towards the lake in the morning at 6 a.m. and return to their nest located near the coast at 6 p.m. This makes for a stunning sight at these times every day. Early morning is a mystical time to view the lake or covered in a fine mist. Engel escorts the summer to the peak of the mountain located opposite side of the lake, where they command a fantastic view of the surroundings. Tondano Lake. Yes, Engel, it's beautiful. This is Tondano Lake. Magnificent. Wow, beautiful. In the far distance, the active Mount Sopotan puffs a plume of smoke, easily visible in the early morning light. The red morning sun rises from the east behind the mountain and herons fly over the lake towards south for the day. The best way to fully enjoy the delights of Tundano Lake is early morning on a small single engine boat which can easily be hired lakeside. From here you can observe the dramatic volcanoes of Sopotan, Flabat and Lokon. The lake itself is a huge caldera lake which was once a very active volcano prior to erupting in prehistoric times. The remains of the bottom of the crater is now filled with fresh water covering 4,278 hectares, 14 kilometers long and 6 kilometers wide. Isamu? Yes. Uh, welcome to Tondano Lake. Thank you. My name is Kiki Montong. Mr. Warwick is my father-in-law. Have you tried uh, jet ski? No, I haven't tried it before. This is my first time. I'm excited. Oh, okay. I can teach you to ride jet ski now. Okay, let's go. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Thank you. Let's go. You must use this because this is for safety. Yeah, let's go. No problem. What's that? Beautiful. I can try along.
This is the end of volume one. But before I finish this program, let me say goodbye to everybody who joined this program. And I'll see you again in volume two. See you again now. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. See you again, yeah. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, Samo. Please come again. Yes, I do. I do. Surely I do. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. See you, Samo. Okay. Bye bye. Come back again. Thank you very much. I'm surely coming back. Have a good trip. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. See you again. See you soon. Bye bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Samu. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you. Come back again. Yes, I do. This brings us to the end of Volume One, and we look forward to welcoming you back for Volume Two. Bye. Yes, I'll come back. Bye bye. Thank you.